agriculture, the worship of trees plays a significant part. Since ancient times, people have been worshipping trees by associating them with gods. Trees are worshipped as a matter of gratitude as no life forms can exist without trees. However, there are some trees which are considered to be holy in their own right in Hinduism. The people tree, also known as the Bodhi tree, is worshipped as it is believed that Buddha had attained enlightenment under the Bodhi tree. Thus, the Bodhi tree is of great significance to the Buddhists. The Ashoka tree is associated with Kamadev, the god of desire. In Sanskrit, Ashoka means no grief or one who does not give grief. In the Ramayan, Sita, after her abduction by Ravan, was kept under an Ashoka tree. The Tulsi plant is regarded as a manifestation of Tulsi, the consort of Vishnu. The leaves of the Tulsi plant are used in the worship of Vishnu and are used to make garlands for him. Planting the Tulsi plant at the entrance of one's home is considered auspicious. The Banyan tree is considered to be a symbol of the three gods, Shiv, Vishnu and Brahma. Most people believe that the banyan tree represents life and fertility. Some trees like the neem tree or the sandalwood tree have medicinal value. With the passage of time, these medicinal trees have also gained religious sanctity. Vidur played an important role in the administration of the kingdom until Duryodhan took over as king. The celebrations of Guru Nanak Jayanti begin with early morning processions at Gurudwaras known as Prabhat Feri and spread to the neighborhood. 